Hi there, it's Grant here and in this video um, I just want to sort of flick read through um, an article that Tika Tuara has done where he is proclaiming this is the last best crypto opportunity of our lifetime and um, I'm just going to flick through this article and give you a bit of context of what it's about and why I think this is important um if you're interested in investing in crypto because i think there's exciting times ahead now basically if you're interested in tika tawari he's been very quiet over the past year usually every year or every six months he comes out with a huge promotion or sort of announcement uh, to do with crypto and that hasn't happened because as we all know the crypto market has been in the gut ever since war in ukraine crypto and in fact the whole financial market has struggled but especially crypto has been some big name bankruptcies and all sorts of shenanigans and a lot of crypto investors have left the space and a lot of people are proclaiming that crypto is dead but Tika has come out um, and announcing that what's ahead of us in crypto could be the best and last great opportunity to invest in crypto to make some huge amounts of money so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to read this for you now and then i'm going to give you my opinion of it so in this article teak is basically saying we're in a special moment of history we're essentially in a crypto bear market um crypto's plummeted but he's basically attributing this to the same you know position that we're in in the dot-com crash in 2000 where Many there were many high-profile blocks such as Pets.com was a you know crashed. Obviously, Microsoft dipped, Amazon dipped. Uh, you know, and in 2000, only 250 million people were using the in internet, and by 2010, that number hit two billion. Now, Tika thinks we're in exactly the same position in crypto as we were back in 2000, where there was a big blow-up, a big crash, and then over the coming 10 years the internet rebounded and Tika thinks that's what's going to happen with crypto um, and he's making the argument and it's a it, it's a very strong argument you know why would crypto exchange such as Coinbase sign up 1500 new institutional clients in the last six months alone including BlackRock the 10 trillion dollar behemoth and world's largest money manager and in fact BlackRock has gone big into crypto. So you need to ask the question, why are companies like Coinbase signing up, you know, 1,500 new institutional clients who want to invest in crypto? Why is BlackRock going big into crypto? Now, keep that thought in your head. Um, and why would venture capital money flow into crypto in the last six months of 2022 at the heart of this bear market? So we need to ask, sort of why this is happening and lots of other financial you know sort of um, institutions are flooding into crypto as well so Tika goes on to say simply put those in, who control the most wealth on the planet no crypto isn't a, is own, isn't only far from dead but it is a key piece of the entire global economy moving forward um, currently only 3.75% 3, 3 of the world's population has crypto exposure just 300 million people but according to a former Goldman Sachs fund manager the number will be 5 billion people by 2030 over half the global population that's why investors who actually understand crypto are licking their lips at this opportunity I'm um, just going to flick through you know what we know and basically Teak is building uh, the argument that seeing we're you know we're in a crypto bear market and crypto many of the top cryptos and including many smaller cryptos are at rock bottom prices so basically we buy now and then when the crypto bull market returns which could return in the next six to twelve months huge gains will be will be had now um basically tika's making an argument as well but web3 will change the internet uh so web Web 1 was the beginning of the internet where you could read websites. Web 2 is what we got now. Uh, allows mobile computing and social networks. But Big 3 is going to be the next version of the internet. And a lot of, without reading this all for you because I don't want to bore you, Web 3 is 
a lot of it is going to run um, on um, the blockchain and have crypto technology. So rather than having a centralized internet, it's going to be decentralized. Um, and Tika's, you know, making an argument here that, you know, Web3 is going to be huge and it's going to be a big part of crypto. Um, and we, he's basically saying here that the own, you know, the ownership economy is coming on us, um, where basically, you know, you can you can own pieces of the internet. Um, I'm not going to go massively into it because I'm still trying to wrap my head around Web3 myself. But basically, this is really the crux of what Teak is getting at. This He thinks this is going to be the final crypto bear market we're going to have. Um, and basically, now is probably the best buying time that we've had in a very long time to invest in crypto to make huge gains. So I'm just going to read the passing comments. He, says, he basically says, look, I understand fear is keeping you out of crypto, which makes sense because crypto's, a lot of people lost money in crypto recently. You know, the media is full of negative hype. Uh, but if you kind of zoom out and look at the broader crypto market, many casual investors are selling their positions and institutional institution investors are racing into crypto fertility. Goldman Sachs, JC Morgan, Berkshire Hathaway, and, which is quite interesting because, um, you know, uh, Berkshire Hathaway, I can't remember, oh God, you know what, I can't remember the guy who owns it now. He's a massive, world's biggest investor. He's very negative on crypto, but, you know, uh, Warren Buffett, sorry. But Warren Buffett, owner of Berkshire Hathaway, has taken a 500 million stake in a digital bank offering its own cryptocurrency. So you have to ask yourself why. So Tika closes out. So again, moving into crypto now could be the like buying Amazon for $6 after it fell 93% in the dot-com crash. And he's saying that's the opportunity in front of us today. And it's why I, he's, he's held a special event called Big T's Final Call. And I'll come to that in a minute. Um... So basically, Tika's in a nutshell, Tika's essentially saying that now is the best time and probably the last time to invest in crypto and get rock bottom prices before the bear market comes. Now, my, I'm, I'm, uh, I invest in crypto. I'm not a huge investor. You know, I'm not a crypto millionaire, but I do have quite a few positions in crypto and I can see exactly where Tika Tuari is coming from because you know, the crypto market has been in the gutter. You know, I know Bitcoin has rebounded a bit, um, but it, it's three times down on its peak um, just over a year ago. Um, and a lot of high quality crypto projects, Ethereum, which is which is the largest software development platform on the blockchain, Ethereum's going to be huge. Solana, Polkadot, all of these top cryptos are trading pretty much at their all-time lows and many other you know promising projects um, like singularity net which is a crypto AI platform and AI is going to be huge um, fetch.ai all of these projects are pretty much you know trading for peanuts and when the crypto bull run comes around uh, we are going to see mammoth Gains. I've got no doubt about that. Obviously, no one really knows when the crypto bull run is going to come, but it is going to come at some point. With you know, without without a doubt, I, I truly, truly believe that. And another thing you should know: Bitcoin's got its next halving. I think in March 2024. And what the halving means is that the amount of Bitcoin um, in circulation halves, and that's going to reduce supply and prices are going to hike so the bitcoin bull market for war in ukraine eases this year or stops um, and we see improvements in the economy and reduction in interest rates that could be a signal for the start of the bull run i think it could either come at some point this year later on in the year or more likely in 2024 so time is on your side but in many ways it isn't because no one knows when the bull run will return and this is what Tika is getting at and that is why he's you know he's um, done a special event called uh, Big T's 
final call, which I'm just going to look at it here. Um, basically, this is the first big interview Tika Tawari has done, um, you know, since really, well, in over a year. Tika hasn't done anything like this in a year. And Tika Tawari only comes out when he spots opportunity. And Tika's spotting huge opportunity because he thinks this is the final bear crypto bear market we will see. Um, and in this interview, which is about an hour long, he explains the opportunity in front of us and he explains why is now why now is the best time to invest in crypto. And also naturally with Tika, he's found some big opportunities that can make some huge gains to invest in certain cryptocurrencies. So if you wanna if you wanna watch Big T's final call, Tika Tawari's final call interview, which he talks about the final crypto bear market and talks about some great crypto projects to invest in so you can earn big when the crypto bull market returns. I'm going to put a link to this interview down in the description. Just click the link and it'll be brought straight to this page. You can watch the interview. I watched it. It's a really intriguing watch. Um, Tika's back to his best. If you love Tika, you're going to love this interview. He's back to his best. Um, I know we've kind of all met. I know not everyone loves him. A lot of people don't. Uh, but I really enjoy listening to his thoughts. And I think he's absolutely on the money uh, with his call here. Because I'm spotting opportunity everywhere in crypto at the moment especially in the ai niche because ai is blowing up web free gaming and decentralized finance those are the areas in the future they're going to absolutely explode and make millionaires in crypto so if you want to watch big t's final call interview i'm going to link to it in the description it's a great watch and i think you'll really enjoy it anyway if you've got value from this video why not like it why not subscribe to the channel to get more content like this. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me and I'll speak to you soon.